Welcome to the Mud Shop Showroom. Uh, today I just wanted to feature a few items. These are flower pot buddies. You take them and put them down in your flower pots. And they stick up and give character to your plants. Very cute. Different ones. I'm sure you'll find one that meets your style. All different color hats and different type faces and hair bows and some that just has hair and no hat. Also have uh, Easter bowls. This one is colored like an Easter egg. Also have paper towel holders, uh, bunny plates, <clears throat> Easter basket tags. These in the back are like for Mother's Day gift tags. And you just flip them over write their name on it, tie it up on a, with a ribbon, and uh, different colors. Got the pastel colors, lavender, pink, green, and then this one is Georgie's Interactive Pigments with a clear on top. Also have fit, finished some of the garden bells. Here they are. Oh, I'm trying to hold this camera with one hand. Um, this one has butterflies. It is the Georgie's Interactive Pigments with a little green on the top and uh, clear on the bottom. Also have one in blue that is finished. This one is two-tone. It is the uh, indigo pigments um, with clear on top. And then I did a little sapphire float on top of it. And this one is birds. Because the uh, print on it, the texture on it, is the Scandi bird. Also, like for Easter, I have several different egg platters. I have one like this, the teal color. I have multiple colors. I have a yellow one trimmed in black. Um, I have this egg bowl. Now, this you can put on a plate stand as de uh, decoration for Easter. But when you use the inside of it, it has uh, the um, peacock glazing on the inside. So you can use it year-round. All right. I also have down here some more egg plates. This is a red. Uh, this one is a two-piece set. The trivet comes out. You can use it together as an egg tray. Take it, the trivet out and use the platter by itself. Also, I have more bunny plates. This one has flower stamps on it, kind of placed where it looks like the face of the bunny rabbit. This one is just uh, the bunny texture and uh, Georgie's interactive pigments and clear glaze on it. Uh, here are a couple more egg plates, egg trays. This one is the copper. Also have one more large Egg plate. This platter is uh, the ancient copper also. With, uh, I think that's sapphire float on the inside, which is a blue. You can see. <clears throat> but there are many other things to see here in the mud shop. A few more little bunny plates. Um, this is a little bunny spoon breast. Many things to see. You can, uh, this actually is a domed platter. It is large. This is a 12 inch platter with a dome lid. You can actually put a pound cake in it. Uh, let's see, spoon holders, the utensil holders, uh, pet dishes, all kinds of things. So come see me, give me a call, send me a message if I'm here. You're welcome to come by and look. This is another egg platter, which is uh, hand painted. Um, just give you a good look. Here's another bunny plate. All right, here's some spring platters with butterflies and some spring colors. This bowl was made with colored clay. I wedged white clay and I mixed 
blue color into the clay and then wedged them together to give the marbled look. I still have plenty uh, plant planters. Uh, these are little um, succulent planters. Lots of things to look at. This is a larger garden bell. It's a lot like the ones I have hanging outside. It has a chicken hanging from it. I have a bunny luminary house. You can put the tea light inside or you can put the little fairy lights inside. If you put a candle in it, the chimney is open so the smoke will come out of the chimney. You can see I have the tiered platters. Now you can take them apart and use the separate plates or you can put two tier or all three tier. Your choice. Over here, I have a few more little spring plates. These are uh, cheese boards or a cutting board. This one is the ancient copper. And this one has another color on it. It was river rock with snow over the top. And on the back of these, they're also textured and colored. You can see on the back. Of course, I still have jewelry and things. Jewelry holders. Uh, just all kind of stuff. I have these hanging on the wall. You can see these are um, cameo pendants. These are necklace sets. These have the earrings that match. I have butter dishes on the bottom shelf. I have a smaller lidded platter. Here's the, the inside of the lid. Uh, don't mind the vacuum cleaner. I have had infestation of those little beetle bugs. Look like ladybugs that aren't. Anyway, I'm cleaning them up. Uh, colanders. Spring mugs. Oh, hard to see here. I'm going to have to get out of the sunlight. Here's my shelf of mugs. And I do still have the spring cups. Mugs of all different shapes and sizes. Here's mug sets with bunny rabbits on them. It's a hand painted bunny on the lid. There's also a bunny on the plate. And that's the complete set. It's $30 for the little plate, the mug, the spoon and the, the lid, the topper. Here's another set that in a different color. This has the bunny on the cup, bunny on the lid, and the matching spoon. But I have all different things. You just have to see the variety. Tumblers, wall, hanging decorations, the churches and the chickens and the flowers and the cross. I have some more crosses in the making. These are refrigerator magnet crosses, different things. This shelf, I have my lavender basket. These little bowl baskets, mixing cups, pictures, tea pitchers, all kinds. Then I have Mississippi plate. This is a large platter. It's about 12 to 14 inches long. The smaller Mississippi plates. And I still have one Mississippi spoon rest left. And of course I have the little keychains that are the Mississippis. Here are some more baskets. These are 
woven baskets. You just have to come out and see. And these are my chip and dip sets. A little dark down here. Light on the top, dark on the bottom. All right, so come see me. I'd love to, to have you come visit the mud shop. Again, this was to announce I had the bells ready. I'm headed down now to go glaze some more pieces. I have four more bells in the making. We'll see what color they turn out to be. All right, thank you for joining me in the mud shop showroom. Come by and see me anytime. Bye.